This day the fiery angels descended to the Lord's tomb watchers. A fire and spirit cried aloud, Holy, holy, God has risen from the grave in glory and great power. And the guards trembled and fell, and they became like dead men at the side of the watchers, Barak Moore. The priests inquired of the guards, do the seals remain intact with one voice? All the guards said the seal remains unbroken. See for yourself the wonder which made us all like dead men. It may have been a vision, but we cannot hide the truth which has been made known to us unto the ages of ages and forevermore. Grand rest to our departed, those who have gone to the rest at your worshippers among the company of your saints. When you sit on your throne to divide the good from evil, let them behold your mercy. May they stand at your right hand when your majesty appears. Lord, have mercy upon us and help us. In the garden, Mary saw the Son of God. She perceived him who had risen as the gardener. He asked her, Why do you weep? Whom do you seek? I weep for I do not know where they took my Lord. He called to her, saying, Mary. Then she knew the voice of her Lord. She ran to tell the apostles, Christ is risen, but more. Praise to the Son of God who rose from the grave, who destroyed Zion and betrothed the church instead. He sat within her a table of blessing, and for her mixed his living flesh and precious blood. He redeemed the church by his cross and gave life to her by her death. Praise to him who grants pardon through his flesh and blood unto the ages of ages and forevermore. Hallelujah. Let us beseech Christ for all the departed who ate his body and drank his life-giving blood, that the darkness of sin not reign over them, over their souls and their spirits in the kingdom. Lord, receive the spirits of those who confessed you and your passion. Call to them and raise them up at your right hand side.